Hello everyone and welcome to the next video in the series. This is a technical skills video on the topic of ordering integers. By ordering integers, we mean listing them in the order that they appear on the number line. An image of the number line is on the right side. Here we've got the numbers 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, as well as the negative integers, negative 1, negative 2, negative 3, negative 4. And the pattern continues on both sides. Given two integers, the one on the left is less than the one on the right. As an example of that, 1 is less than 3. We can say that 0 is less than 2. Negative 1 is less than 1. And we can say that negative 4 is less than negative 2. And uh, note that it does make sense for us to say that negative 4 is less than negative 2. If you owe $4, you're in a worse situation compared to the case if you owed $2. So in a sense, owing $4 means that you're lower than the situation where you would have, uh, where you owed $2. You would be sort of like at a higher point compared to negative 4. And uh, it should be noted that this implies that on the, on the negative side, the number that has a larger size is actually the smaller of the, uh, of the numbers. Uh, if, uh, if you have two numbers, the one, uh, the one with the larger size is the smaller of the two, and the one with the smaller size is the larger of the two. Here's the problem. Which is larger, negative 8 or negative 1? If you visualize negative 8 and negative 1 on the number line, negative 8 is on the left of negative 1. And therefore, we can say that negative 8 is less than negative 1. Or we can say that negative 1 is larger than negative 8. So the answer to this problem is negative 1. Sometimes we are given a set of numbers and uh, we are asked to arrange them in either increasing order or decreasing order. Such as this problem. Arrange negative 4, 3, negative 2, 0, and 4 in increasing order. Now, increasing order means from smallest to largest. So as we go through the list, the size of the numbers increase. And therefore, we should start with the smallest of the numbers. Now, the smallest number is the one that appears to the left of all the other numbers. In this case, uh, we have negative 4. And uh, negative 4 is to the left of all the other numbers that are given to us. And therefore, the list begins with negative 4. Following this, we have negative 2 which is here, and then 0, 3, and 4. So the answer to the question is negative 4, negative 2, 0, 3, 4. Here is uh, another example with larger numbers. Arrange 210, negative 105, 0, negative 340, and 250 in decreasing order. Now this time we have to go from the largest, from largest to smallest, because it's a decreasing order, which means as we go through the list, the size of the numbers goes down, uh, or we go towards smaller and smaller numbers. The largest number in the set is 250, followed by 210, and then 0. So far, it's not that difficult. Keep in mind that on the negative side, the number that has a smaller size is the larger of the two, and the one that has a larger size is the smaller of the two. And therefore, negative 105 is larger than negative 340. And the solution to the problem becomes 250, 210, 0, negative 105, followed by the smallest number, number in the set, which is negative 350. And uh, that's it for this short video on ordering integers. Uh, join me next uh, in the next video where I will talk about uh, addition and subtraction of integers. Take care everyone and for now I will be gone in 3, 2,